Hey everyone, so here's a question from rational numbers and the question here is how to find the rational numbers between 2 and 3. So this type of questions are really important. So how to find them? So in the questions they may ask you to find the 3 rational numbers, 5 rational numbers or 10 rational numbers. It's very easy the method remains same for any question of this type. Alright, let's start the solution. So we have a solution here. So if you see we have a 2 and 3. We know that 2 and 3 are integers, they are whole number, they are also rational number. How they are rational number? I can write 2 and 3 as 2 upon 1 and 3 upon 1. This will not going to change the number. 2 upon 1 is 2 and 3 upon 1 is also 3. So just to make it look like a rational number, I am writing it as 2 upon 1 and 3 upon 1. Now, they are asking to find the rational numbers between this 2 and 3. And we also know that between 2 and 3, there is no much gap, right? Then how to find out? So what I'm going to do here is, I'm going to uh, find the equivalent rational number between, uh, like, equivalent rational number of 2 upon 1 and 3 upon 1. And then I'm going to find out. Now why I'm finding this equivalent rational number? So that the gap between these two numbers will increase. And I can able to get the rational numbers between them. So this is one easy way to find out. So here I am going to multiply with 10. Now you can multiply with any number. You have learned how to find out the equivalent rational number. Yeah, you can multiply with any number, right? So here I am going to take 10. Why I am taking 10? Because it's easy to calculate. So 2 upon 1, I am going to multiply with the 10. So this is 20 upon 10. So 20 upon 10 is equivalent rational number of uh, 2 upon 1. Again, I'm going to have a 3 upon 1 multiply with 10. See, we should multiply with same number. If if I multiply with 20 for 3 upon 1, I'll get 60 upon uh, 20. But denominators are not same here. We have to make sure that denominators are same. That is why multiplying with 10 for both the numbers. Now here, I got 20 upon 10 and I got 30 upon 10. Now between 20 to 30, I have a many numbers like 21, 22, so on up to 29. So if they're asking to find out three rational numbers, you can just pick up three rational number like 21 upon 10 and then 22 upon 10 or 25 upon 10. It's completely on you. If they're asking to find out a uh, five rational number, take any five between them. If they're asking more rational number, you can multiply with more number. Like here I've multiplied with 10. You can multiply with uh, 20. You can also multiply with five. It's completely on you with which number you're multiplying. But make sure that you're getting a sufficient rational numbers between them. So from here, I'm gonna conclude, therefore, Therefore, rational numbers between rational numbers between two and three are. It's like it's gonna start from twenty one. Don't take twenty. They are asking between. So twenty one upon ten, twenty two upon ten, and then twenty three upon ten so on up to 29 upon 10. Now one more important point between two rational numbers are infinitely many rational numbers so it's not necessary that everyone answer should match here my answer may be different than your answer or the answer in the textbook may be different than the answer you're getting so it's not compulsory everyone should get same answer it's completely on you with which number you're multiplying I hope it's clear. Now in case you have any specific question, you can put it down in the comment and I try to make a video on it. Thank you so much for watching.